Noida, short for New Okla Industrial Development Authority, is about 16 miles southeast of New Delhi, India. Famous for its tall buildings, the integrated township is shaping up to be India's smartest city, the national capital region's most modern urban development center, and its fastest developing center of attraction. Attracted to Noida's favorable atmosphere and efficient infrastructure, Stefanini chose Noida to host one of our offices in India. Come take a look. My name is Sushmita. I'm Noida Facility Manager. I'm with Stefanini for around five years. Our office in Noida is located in Sector 62, is one of the prime IT corporate area of the city. The building has 24 by 7 security guards with controlled access, permanent video surveillance and secured underground parking. Our company is organized around 30,000 square feet and 700 seats. In addition to what building is providing, we have our own security guards and Stephanie reception available during normal working hours. To access our facility, each employee must be authenticated by physical access control to enter to each door through their ID badge received on their first day of work. Inside our premises, we have permanent video monitoring and access is restricted to unauthorized personnel. With appropriate level of access, each secured area, office and server room. Records will be kept as to whom is allowed to access each of these facility and logs will be maintained to identify everyone who is entered and exited to the any secured area. All Stephanie visitors must sign in and sign out through main reception lobby for proper identification. Throughout the visit, our guests are required to wear self-expiring badge provided during sign-in to remain with their escort while visiting the office or in assigned working area. They are also required to read and acknowledge non-disclosure and waiver agreement and they must follow the same procedure on each day of their visit in our premises. When a user ends or completes working relationship with Stephanie, all security codes known, physical access and badges will be disabled or changed immediately according to the policies in place. Thank you. Hi, my name is Sushil Kumar and I'm here to present you about the technical security aspects of Stephanie Noida office. As our network security perspective, we use checkpoint with IPS functions enabled. For the VPN connectivity, we use comprise of Cisco ASA and the open VPN with PFSense. And our VPN solutions are multi-factor authentication. Our Wi-Fi is based on Cisco wireless controller and for authentication, we have NPS certificates or AD credentials. Our SOC team is taking, analyzing and responding to security alerts generated by SOCOS and point protection. All incidents are logged in our global surveillance tool for tracking and auditing. We perform our internal audits regularly to ensure that our policies and procedures are properly enforced. We ensure end point protection. We ensure tempered password policies and make SOFOS and put protection not only for intrusion prevention and detection but also filtering unwanted applications. We are regularly improving our capabilities so that we can provide end user good experience without compromising security. Hi, my name is Richard Gaur and I'm Stephanie India Country Head. I lead all the operations and delivery for India. We have three delivery centers in India. Each of our delivery center has variety of services, but each delivery center has focus services as well, such as NOIDA is focused on enterprise services. Enterprise consists of multiple vertical, uh, infrastructure services, security services, and user computing. Hyderabad's delivery center has primary offering towards application services and ERP services. We are SAP partners, we are global SAP partners. Our field services executives are spread across the country and they are serving multiple clients. Hi, my name is Manmohan and I'm the India Operations Manager for RIM Enterprise Services. I've been with Stephanie for the past five years now and during this time, I've played multiple roles like EMT lead, infra lead, infra delivery manager and currently the India Operations Lead for RIM Enterprise Services. 
the RIM services include support for data center and user as well as security services. Under data center services, we provide end-to-end -end management for server management, network management, backup and restore, storage, database administration, EMT and ICMIM services. As part of cloud support services, we have a team of cloud architects who provide services for Azure, AWS as well as Google Cloud Platform. Apart from it, we also provide services for virtual servers, virtual desktops, O365 and many other cloud applications. As part of end user services, we provide support for Workplace Anywhere, Unified to Endpoint Management and Virtual Client Services. As part of security services, we provide support for security operations center, identity and access management, endpoint security management, enterprise mobility and security EMS, and vulnerability management. Hi, my name is Jasdeep Singh, and I'm working with Stephanie Lee as a lead technology consultant for enterprise mobility management for various clients like DeVry University, Cineverse, uh, Black & Veatch, and Toyota Connected. Uh, my team uh, look after the uh, management of various endpoints like Windows, Mac OS, iOS and Android. Our team uh, manages uh, bring your own devices and company owned endpoints uh, and the security of corporate owned data along with automated device enrollment process. Uh, we have expertise on various leading mobile device management solutions like Microsoft Intune, uh, that is Endpoint Manager, Jaff Pro, AirWatch, uh, that is also known as now Workspace ONE. Uh, we have been working on uh, projects for modern device management, uh, that is Windows Autopilot, and automated device enrollment for Apple devices. Uh, amidst COVID-19, uh, majority of employees are working from home, so it has become an essential to deliver the Windows 10 or Mac OS devices to, uh, to employees or to users at the ease of their homes. And the setup of devices can be done without or with the minimal support of IT team. Windows Autopilot uh, enable uh, employees to work from almost any location and are better equipped to collaborate remotely and uh, Windows Autopilot is is actually a cloud-based deployment technology uh, which enables deployment and configuration of devices over the internet uh, which requires Azure uh, Active Directory and uh, micro uh, or mobile device management solutions such as Microsoft Intune uh, it further simplifies and speed up the device deployment. As soon as the Windows machine is unboxed and turned on by the employee, it will be transformed uh, with minimal user interaction and will be ready for productive use. Uh, as a part of deployment process, hardware vendors like Dell, uh, Hewlett Packard, uh, Lenovo enables uh, the Windows hardware IDs that are also called as hash IDs with Windows Autopilot. And on the other part, IT admins enables hybrid Active Directory join with configuration of Microsoft Azure Active Directory that is also known as Intune or ODG connector on Windows Server 2012 R2 or more with ADFS and configures the Windows Autopilot profiles um, which gets synced uh, with the Windows Autopilot devices. Hardware renders or organizations uh, then ships the uh, devices to employees directly. Employees just need to unbox a device and it gets ready for productive use with minimal user interaction. Uh, likewise, we can deploy Mac OS devices uh, with automated device enrollment process, which requires a uh, mobile device management solution like Microsoft Intune, that is Endpoint Manager or Jaff Pro uh, and Apple Business Manager. Uh, in this process, uh, authorized Apple reseller or that is uh, hardware renders uh, enables the device, the serial number of devices in organizations Apple Business Manager in which 
IT admins uh, configures the mobile device management solution uh, or mobile device management server and creates automated uh, or auto enrollment profiles compliance policies uh, within mobile device management um, such as uh, Microsoft Intune or uh, Jav Pro. Uh, once macOS device gets shipped uh, to an employee, it just needs to be unboxed and which gets uh, verified on Apple Business Manager uh, as an automated process and then syncs with the mobile device management enrollment profile uh, and compliance policies which which uh, which has been designed or configured within the uh, you know mobile device management solution uh, after that all the required applications uh, get deployed automatically and the device uh, gets set up within just few minutes for the productive use Thank you. Hi, I'm Sanmit Grover, Group Manager for Event Management and Triage Team. And I have been working with Stephanini from the past five years. At Stephanini, the EMT team acts as a single point of contact for all alerts, events, incidents, and escalations from his uh, service. EMT team is also responsible for event detection, end to end monitoring of infrastructure systems and platform few, uh, with including few flavors like application support, BDI support, VoIP, network management, platform support, cloud support and endpoint management and security. We take care of any kind of threshold management for the customer environment as per the trend analysis. We ensure that end-to-end -end integrations as per the customer environments are delivered to integrate event management services. Once an issue is detected, EMD team takes care of its life cycle starting from logging the event, tracking the event, uh, performing triage at the event and following up on an end-to-end -end closure of that ticket. The follow-up happens end-to-end. -end. Providing 24-7 coverage, we ensure that the alert remediation is done within the SLA or the ticket is triaged to the next level for further support. For there are any systems where automated monitoring or tool-based monitoring is not in place, we ensure that manual monitoring is done. EMT team defines classification of an incident on and as agreed with the customers. For any of the major incidents, we initiate the problem ticket as well as find the root cause for resolving the issues. In case of any recurring issues or trends, we work with the respective stakeholders to remediate and apply the fix for permanent closure. The thresholds for the alerts are managed in accordance with the accounts or the customers and we are uh, complying to them accordingly. Thank you. Hello, my name is Prince Vishnoi. I am Service Delivery Manager for Matthew's project. As a part of current role, I am responsible to ensure that all the virtual desktop infrastructure services supported by Stephanie should function properly. For the VDI end user computing support, Stephanie has a core and dedicated team of technical employees distributed across the India. The technical team of people working across 24 by 7 to support the VDI environment for customer remotely that leverage our deep expertise and dedicated assistance to users for their specific needs. We help to drive the efficiency and reliability of customers' VDI environment. In customer business environments, we manage application and desktop virtualization, centralize apps and desktops in the data center rather than on local devices. This allows IT to deliver apps and desktops to users on demand to any device anywhere hence increasing the productivity. A part of the standard BU activities for VDI services, our dedicated engineers are involved in various IT projects run by our client, like setting and supporting, preparing the IT infrastructure required for VDI deployment and end-user computing. We have implemented IT governance and centralized management to support our customer concerns or issues they might be facing. 
we are well connected with our client infrastructure and have an open communication to their entire IT organization. Our technical team supporting VDI infrastructure provides the outcome driven consulting services that help customers to reimagine to do better work for their customers and while showing how to master the complexities of technology to fulfill customer business goals. Hey, my name is Saurav and I'm working with Stephanie for over three years. I'm working here as an operation lead for Microsoft Endpoint Configuration Manager for our client Black & Beach. My team looks after management of endpoints which includes operating system deployments, operating system upgrades, software distribution, delivery of software updates to endpoints, uh, hardware and software inventory management, SSRS reporting. We also provide customized application solution where applications are modified as per customer needs uh, and are delivered via configuration manager. Hi, this is Shraddha, Senior HR Manager from India HR Team. We called our human resource team as People and Culture Team. I am here with this organization for about 15 years and uh, we are having three offices here in India with about 850 plus resources spread across the three uh, offices and we have uh, other client locations as well. We uh, consider employee as one of the uh, assets, key assets, valuable assets of our organization. Each location is having HR presence to take care of the employee needs. We ensure that every employee is given equal opportunity. We focused on our employees' step area development to various progression plan, and uh, we lead the organization various training and development programs. We have our internal development programs, training programs through our Stephanie University through Persipio that provides various trainings and learning activities to our employees to make sure there are technical skills both they have their interpersonal soft skills we provide the trainings the training programs are very structured organized to make sure they are attached to the kpis as well for the employees here hr is in india is involved starting from the onboarding to exit process to make sure employees we are engaged with employees with various activities